The last but not the least is how to organize your workspace. So we found out that if we go to view and have a window, we can activate Clash Detective, we can activate Timeliner, or we can activate Rendering or other windows. And it's not enough even a couple of great screens to have enough for area to have all these tools in one. And so sometimes we work with Timeliner, sometimes we work with Clash Detective and with other tools. And you can organize your, your workspace. For example, let's do it for animation. Let's go to the home button and press animator, scripter, even a couple of them, and talk them. And select this one, and yeah, I need a selection tree. And I want to save this workspace. I can go to viewpoint, to view, and then save workspace. Let's save it and name it animation. And in any time, you can change your workspace. This is one thing. Load workspace. And let's go to minimal. No windows. I'll go back to standard. I'll go to the other one. View. Load workspace and animation. And now we have some list of your workspaces and use them when you need and change it very quick. And of course, when you save it, you can you use the special workspace folder and you can change it if you need. And then you can change everything for yourself and organize your workspace to have a very productive and easy workflow.